they're lined up. And as they go through the first furlong, uh, paces could be a problem, but Cruising Heights and Pataderia are going to take care of it, and they lead by a length. So it's Cruising Heights, the leader. Carter Jana shows second. Ruby Tiger, the grey, next to the rails, third. Sharing that place with Wadjid in four, length and a half back to game plan. And then just uh, six of the six is Hellenic in the very pale jacket. No change through the first quarter mile, and Cruising Heights leading. By a clear by a couple of lengths now to Carter Jana in second, a gap of two to game plan going through into third and then Ruby Tiger in four and wedged in the maroon white sleeves in five and then Hellenic is sixth. Little change as they come down towards the mile pole and the pace looks uh, quite a good one. Pat Edery makes the running on cruising heights. From water swim burn on Carter Jana in second and then game plan is third followed by Ruby Tiger and wedged and the back marker is Hellenic and they pass the seven pole and it's Cruising Heights still showing the way. Cruising Heights, daughter of Shirley Heights, here by a couple of links to Carter Jana in second and then game plan showing third, followed at the halfway stage by Ruby Tiger next to the rails in four, and then Wedge on the outside five, and Hellenic is six. They turn into the home straight with five furlongs to go and it's Cruising Heights leading from Carter Jana in second and then game plan showing third as they head for home and they're in the home straight still Cruising Heights from the front Cruising Heights from Carter Jana and game plan and then Wudge and then Ruby Tiger and Hellenic with quite a bit to do and then coming down towards the three and Carter Jana starts to uh, make ground on the outside of Cruising Heights and Pat Henry now goes to work as Carter Jana uh, applies the pressure and these come to three clear of Wedge looking one pace at this stage Ruby Tiger runs a big race and a brave race too but Carter Jana has the call now by a length and a half Ruby Tiger Wedge Hellenic game plan won't be winning and Carter Jana is starting to tire as Hellenic on the left and the pale blue puts in a big run they're inside the final furlong and it's Hellenic who takes up the initiative now from Carter Jana in second, but Carter Jana fights back. Hellenic has the answer, so it goes on by half by a length. And Hellenic wins it, Carter Jana and Wedge in a photo second third. A big gap to Ruby Tiger and Cruising Heights having their own battle for fourth place. And last of all was game plan. The result then of this Aston Upsthorp Yorkshire Oaks. It's a win for number three, Hellenic, in the colours of Lord Weinstock, trained at Newmarket by Michael Stadd ridden by Willie Carson and that uh, means that Willie Carson has ridden more Yorkshire Oak winners than anyone else. Lester Pickett had ridden four winners and prior to today Willie Carson had ridden four. This makes it five. But there was a little bit of an incident uh, in the closing stages. Carter Jana uh, just had to be checked uh, by Walter Swinburne with about 50 yards to go and she is in a photo with uh, number six Wedge, the French runner who I must say at one stage with two and a half to go really had uh, no sort of chance at all. The head-on will be revealing in this race, this Aston Upthorpe Yorkshire Oaks. It's a Group 1 race, and at this stage, it's gone to Hellenic.